Welcome to Citizens Media Worldwide. As you can see right now, guys, I'm here in Liverpool City Centre. And we're going to ask Member of the Public right now, what is it like and how is it like coming here in a good, hot, sunny day? And what I'm here with, what's your name? Michelle. I'm Michelle. So what do you think about Liverpool? I love it. It's got a really good vibe. The people are amazing. It's very creative. I feel alive when I'm in Liverpool. Yeah. Are you here for shopping? No, I'm here to do a poetry gig. Oh, poetry gig? Yeah. So are you a poet? I am a poet. Oh, right, right, right. So, so where can we find you? Like, your social well, yeah, I'm on um, I'm on Facebook as Shell Wright, yeah. and um, I'm involved with a few projects. A big one in Liverpool called Poets for Peace, yeah. and um, it's involved John Gorman, Brian Patton, the beat poet, and it's going to be a big event in September. There's going to be a big peace campaign and poetry statue, peace tree. Yeah. It's an anthology online called Poets for Peace. But the gig I'm doing today is at Jimmy's at the top of Bold Street. Oh, Jimmy Bold Street. Yeah. It's an open mic night. Oh, right, that's brilliant. So, what, what do you like most about Liverpool? I, I don't know. The history is amazing. Even the negative history is good because I think that Liverpool always addresses its issues. I mean, it's just vibrant. It has a fighting spirit. I just saw a guy with a very interesting sign begging there saying something about Boris Johnson, which I took a photo of, that, which is very cool. And um, the coffee shops, the little quirky shops. I'm going to Probe Records in a minute. Not the original Probe Records, but the yeah. new one. Yeah. It's just the whole history of the music and everything. It's just amazing. So what, what do you like what do you like seeing better, like improved in Liverpool? Less less works going on, less yeah. cranes, less road works, less disruption. Yeah. Uh, more events in the centre here, more community events. Yeah. And um, just a little maybe a bit cleaner as well in the center but otherwise not much it's just all these works that have been going on for years since the city council messed everything up but otherwise i'd say just get more family and community events going on in the center and make it like more attractive to come to but it is a pain with the transport and climbing over barriers and going around things that's the only negative thing i'd say really all right good luck for tonight Okay, thank you. Have a good day. All right, what's your name? Uh, Monty. All right, nice to meet you. So, tell me, tell me about Liverpool. What, uh, what are you local, yeah? Uh, nah, I'm a uni student. I moved from Manchester to Liverpool. Oh, Manchester. Yeah, so, yeah. Uh, like, so, what do you like most about Liverpool? I like that it's a lot smaller. Manchester's too big. Too many people in Manchester. Liverpool's a lot more local. It's better for me. Easy to commute and shit. Yeah. So, is, uh, so what? What is the negative side about Liverpool? Uh, you like, anything like I feel like, um, what's the word now I'm looking for? Uh, diversity. There's not a lot of diversity in Liverpool. Maybe more diversity and stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. What That's about what, what about the shopping centre? What? what nah, I love it, man. Everything's close to unit. I live I, I live like up the road from there. So. Up the road yeah, from there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. So everything's close to me. Would you recommend it to people from money? Yeah, I would. You know, especially if you're a uni student, if you're if you're looking to go uni in Liverpool, 100%. All right, thank you.